The pH scale starts at zero, and a pH of zero means a solution has a concentration of H plus ions of one mole per decimeter cube. As pH value increases, H plus ion concentration in the solution decreases. A change in concentration by a factor of 10 is represented with a change in pH value of one. This is referred to as a base 10 log scale, or common logarithm. For example, as a solution with a pH of zero has a H plus ion concentration of one mole per decimeter cubed, this means a solution with a pH of one has a H plus ion concentration of 0.1 mole per decimeter cube. This is because the pH value has increased by one, meaning a H plus ion concentration decrease of a factor of 10. The really cool thing about this is if we go up to pH 2, the H plus ion concentration decreases by a factor of 10 again, making the H plus ion concentration in a pH 2 solution 0.01 mole per decimeter cube. This means an increase in pH of 2, from 0 to 2 here, means a H plus ion concentration has decreased by a factor of 100. Going up to pH 3 would decrease the H plus ion concentration by 10 times again, making a solution with a pH of 3 a thousand times less acidic than for a solution with a pH of 0. The pH scale runs from 0 to 14, although solutions can have pH values outside of this range. You can see from the graph that we can cover an enormous range of H plus ion concentrations by using just 15 15 values, 0 to 14. A solution with a pH 0 has a H plus ion concentration that is 140 trillion times more concentrated than a solution with a pH of 14. Think about that. We have shown a range of H plus ion concentration of 140 trillion times with using a scale that runs from just 0 to 14. This is what makes the scale logarithmic, and although it can seem a bit confusing for students for the first time, it does make dealing with acidity and H plus ion concentration much easier, even if it doesn't feel like it right now.